Hi Pisces, welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma, so we're gonna be doing your general reading for October, yes, one to seven. So are you excited? This is going to be for all of you, a general message, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus sign in uh, Pisces across watchers. For personal readings and more accuracy, reach out to me on WhatsApp, Instagram, and email. I do my previous spells for your highest good, and we have intention charge pure and energized high vibrational crystals for you. And which are 100% pure, not just pure, but we have the highest grade quality crystals as well. So check out more on my Instagram. Do follow my Instagram page for more details, updates, feedbacks. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment to this channel. Let's see the messages to you. I see three days. Nine of Swords, Queen of Cups. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, or a Taurus, or an Aries. Someone is crying over you. Now, it does not mean that you go back to the person. I'm asking you to go back to the person. I'm just letting you know the energies around you. Like, what is happening around you? What is the most probable situation around you? I'm sensing that there is someone that is craving for your love so badly. There's someone that wants you so bad. This person is not sleeping at night. They're not sleeping well at night. They feel like uh, they've been misunderstood. They want to convey, but they couldn't convey their feelings. And because the suppression of feelings happened, this person is being restless since that day till today. I feel there's someone extremely restless. And they're still in love with you. They still care about you. They have feelings. They had hopes that you and them would get committed or there would have been marriage opportunity. They had high hopes, but their hopes got broken but because they suppressed their feelings. They didn't express themselves. Because they didn't express themselves, the foundation wasn't laid and you felt that this person was just wasting your time and you didn't want to waste your time. So you left the situation. You were like, why should I stay in some situation which is not going to work out? You had this thing already. Pisces being a highly intuitive sign, you felt like there's no future. Maybe there was no future because this person is on a different page in life. You're on a different page in life and you both are very different from each other. So considering all the facts, you didn't see a future over here. But this person has gone too blind. They're just thinking about this, this one thing that they know that they're in love with you. This could be someone emotional, sensitive. They might realize it later on that this is not going to work out. But right now, all they want is just you. So they're not doing well. I feel their health is also bad. I'm also sensing that uh, they have like negative feelings and thoughts coming in. They might be depressed also. So there's a feeling that they've been, I have, I'm feeling like this person is rejecting a lot of marriage opportunities or love offers towards them because they're still stuck on you. There's someone that is definitely stuck on you and is not keeping well. They're not able to focus on their work. Someone could be a company person or a teacher over here that, that is interested in you. On the flip side, Pisces, I'm seeing one more person coming into your life. Very successful, rich, famous. They could have a name, fame. I feel this person has a name, fame, or they have a huge bank balance. I feel this person is pretty stable and secure in their life. So they're definitely more expressive and more confident in approaching you. So you have someone like that approaching towards you, Pisces. I'm also seeing this could be someone on the same page as you are because you're doing pretty well in your life yourself as well. Money is definitely good. So new love is coming around the corner. I have, I can see that you have two to three options because I'm seeing another one. You have one person from the past, one person at your workplace and one person or at your workplace or there could be workplace discussion, work related discussion. And then there is one more person you may meet outside while going out, socializing or going to a party or maybe a gym or stuff like that. So you have three people coming after you, male or female, it does not matter. You have three lovers coming towards you, okay? All of them are expecting the same thing, but their personalities are different. One person, extremely emotional, sensitive, they're going crazy, they're feeling sad, they can't express themselves. 
they are droning in their own emotions and this is giving them anxiety fear depression and sleepless nights another person is all about like being practical logical they are going to take slow steps towards you they're pretty mature they want to lay a solid foundation this person is extremely rich successful but they're too busy with their work another person is highly sexually attracted towards you they keep thinking and fantasizing about you this person could be attractive they love partying they could be an extrovert they could be an adventurous person i feel all these three people are looking for love with you wow so what i'm seeing over here <clears throat> You might be focused on the past person. You might be focused on someone that is emotional and sensitive and going crazy over you. Or that person is coming towards you because out of all of these options, I'm seeing emotions card the most. Like that's popping out. I'm seeing you are going to date all these three people. At least these two new options you're going to date. The past is up to you whether you're giving them a shot or not giving them a shot. That's up to you. But I'm definitely sensing that these two new options are the one that you're definitely going to take them out or they will take you out and you're going to sit and discuss. And I'm sensing one of them is your soulmate. But somehow, I don't know, there is a nostalgia with this person from the past that misses you. You still feel bad for them. You feel nostalgia. There is a feeling that you think that you want to allow them to express themselves at least. If not wanting to be with this, this person, you really want to allow them to be open to you so there could be a possible discussion with the past person that's still not done with you yet i feel you might do a spell on them or they are doing a spell on you if you're not doing a spell on them then definitely this person is doing spells so that you miss them it's it's a harmless spell i feel this person is harmless but yeah they could be a libra gemini aquarius but there's someone from the past that literally wants you to remember the past that literally wants you to miss them and give them a chance so that you guys can connect again so this person is doing anything everything to have you back but not to get you by hook or by crook but to just reconnect so there's someone that is like praying to god maybe or doing some spiritual spells to you know somehow there is a connection back again and then they can discuss with you they can be more open this time they have made a decision that whatever happens they're gonna speak out the truth they're gonna express their emotions no matter how much you reject them they're gonna say that so maybe this person sees you as a soulmate this person still sees you as someone that they want to get married to but somewhere you're stuck between these two options currently you're having these two options are more about me myself but the one that is from the past is more about you so maybe you're missing out on the gem for the two options that you're thinking about now it's up to you to figure out who is the one that you can really trust out of the three options so not so many people are watching this now it could be like the new one is better for some of you it could be the old one is better the past one is better for some of you it's just someone that you're uh, working with that could be better so it is up to you to figure it out but what i'm seeing for most of you i'm sensing that you're more inclined towards the one that you have an emotional connect and it's more about the past person there's some sort of a nostalgia linked with that person so nine of ones you're trying to avoid the feelings that you're having with the past person somewhere like they're sending you hints or they're sending you messages at times but you're avoiding them okay some of you already blocked this person or they blocked you two of ones you really want to stop the chapter you really did this thing earlier that you stopped this person from coming towards you and you started moving forward with new options but since you figure out that these new options are more about themselves then they they, they prioritizing other things over you this is not making you feel good you somewhere want to take a pause and look back to this person that you left behind okay and give them a chance one chance so there is a possibility over here <clears throat> someone's birthday is on 29 king of pentacles i'm seeing you're doing really well money wise pisces i'm seeing you're doing really really well money wise you are the boss here you're gonna be handling the situation very well with money i'm seeing the stable growth there is 
more opportunities opening for you doors opening for you where you can make more money and i'm seeing there is massive growth and abundance coming into your life especially if you could be in crypto or something like that that's also what i'm sensing but you are sensible when it comes to dealing with your money matters i'm definitely seeing there is a promotion there is rise there is success there is an uphill okay you don't have to worry about your money right now the hermit but keep on improving on your skills the moment you stop learning you stop your growth right you've heard about it so i'm seeing over here also in your case pisces keep learning keep growing because that's the way to ultimate success for you pisces all right so i'm seeing most of the time you like to spend alone where you can just learn something new or focus on your work so you have a lot of work going on and you're literally enjoying your work so money 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 everywhere so some of you there's a work going interested in you with whom you have a monetary connection and this person is all about money 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 i feel that's also what i'm sensing but you're just you're just rejecting lovers like anything pisces it's like you have a lot of lovers approaching you but you're just rejecting them like anything because you don't see a soul in any of these you don't see a soul connection you don't see a spiritual bond you don't see someone that can open up their spirit towards you you want to connect on a soul level because the soul is missing because the soul level connection is missing somewhere you still miss the past person you want to give them a chance i'm sensing this energy coming in because you you as time goes forward as time come you know as time passes by you will have even more options coming into your life some of you there is gemini around that you've just rejected all of these options show some sort of a codependency that you do not want okay that's what i'm sensing then we have a death and the devil this could be a capricorn or a scorpio that is just not able to end the chapter with you this person has huge attachment with you and i feel this could be the the one that is going through a lot i feel they're codependent on you they're just not able to close the chapter even though it is closed on the outside but subconsciously they're not done with you yet okay they still fantasize they still think about it they still want to connect i feel like you think this is done but this is not done actually this person is not done with you this could be a scorpio this could be a capricorn they are obsessing day in and day out and they're not sleeping well they're affecting their own health that's the energy that i'm getting here so maybe you might come across this person somehow there is going to be a meeting give it some time i feel like this person may unblock you or you're going to unblock them whatever it is maybe you've not blocked each other but somehow i feel they're blocking this connection or you're blocking this connection it is going to come out slowly and slowly universe will bring you guys together somehow i'm sensing this energy four of swords relax don't focus much it is going to open up on its own what is wrapped what is gone is going to open up again okay so this connection is really going to be reformed that's the energy that i'm getting give it some time you don't want to be in this energy of you know being stubborn towards this person you don't want to be in this stubborn energy anymore you want to give them a shot that's what i'm sensing over here you've been thinking about this person if it's not you guys and know that roles could be reversed maybe they are thinking about you a lot but the problem over here is nobody is taking action because you're too concerned about your ego reputation and money or what other people's people are going to say maybe this person maybe you okay worth waiting for so this person is actually waiting for you but this is worth it because it could be a possible soulmate over you guys are not connected to each other you guys are not talk talking to each other you guys are going in a separation this is someone from the past that's another energy they want another shot and you will hear from this person somehow you might meet this person through work somehow you guys will bump into each other and this will happen naturally but there will still be a lot of words unsaid okay even if you guys come back communicate accidentally so that is why there is a need of one person to reach out to another person so that 
it becomes more comfortable to make a conversation but when you guys bump into each other it's going to be a little awkward and they might not open up too much you might not open up too much so there will be a sense of uh, uh, deception you know expectation that this is not going to work out you know that way Someone is too concerned about their work, their reputation, the image that they carry. This person was hiding their feelings all this while and now they're facing problems because they're not able to forget you. Oh my gosh. There's a huge energy that, you know, this person is keeping from you. I feel like this person wants your love. All there is to love has been you thought this person never liked you but they truly did okay most people are just trying to survive they chose you this person could be a name i'm sensing seek a suggestion here time for you to celebrate life have fun go out party meet new people enjoy life Okay, this is what is going on in your life. I see the signs. Okay. You have a Cancer, you have a Scorpio. You have a Gemini, Aries, Cancer, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus signs. Now let's see all sign messages from Aries to Pisces. What does your person think about you? Aries definitely have a lot to say to you. This person has been waiting and keeping things to themselves for a long period of time. Now they can't resist. Taurus. Taurus sees you as a potential mate, but they want to get to know you more. There's a more, like, I would say this is more of a sexual attraction, but they want to see how it goes. It could be 50-50. It could go any which way. The Gemini. Gemini thinks a lot about you. I feel like they're planning on reaching out to you, communicate with you, how they feel. They've been thinking about you a lot. Cancer. Cancer wants to put on the work here. They really want you and they really think about future with you, a solid foundation with you. Leo. Leo is a little, you know, slow. They don't want to rush. They don't want to mess things up they're pretty like sorted in life so they want to go slowly towards you they want to give you a chance to experience like how this is going to go or they also want to be open to other options at the same time virgo virgo is in two minds right now i feel they're more about their ego. Oh, why do I why do I reach out? They have to reach out first. This is, this is more like a power struggle here. Okay, ego clash, power struggle. And then we have the Libra. Libra is playing hard to get. All they want is just either a revenge or just to get physical. Scorpio. Scorpio is highly attracted towards you, but they're keeping their feelings to themselves. They really want to reach out to you. Somehow they want to bump into you or they want you to reach out to them. Sagittarius. Oh my gosh, this person is in love. They have fallen in love. Okay. Then we have the Capricorn. The Capricorn is... Having a huge crush over you, this person smitten by you, how you carry yourself, your life, how you manage your money. They're just smitten by you. So this person wants to take you out. They're flirting. Aquarius, they want to grow in love. They want to see how it goes. Pisces towards another Pisces. This person has many options, but they're unsure. Like they're more about, uh, you know, they want uh, someone that is less successful than you are or someone that has... Uh, lower ambitions than you are because you are challenging for this person maybe there's a scorpio a taurus that you're dealing with i feel they want to build a family with you or you're going to have a light-hearted family time some of you are going to get married 
Yeah, I'm seeing this ice cream. So I'm seeing baby. You may have a baby with this person. I'm seeing someone wants to like get close to you, get intimate with you. I feel you may get intimate with any of these options. And take care of your health or someone is into fitness. So you might meet in a fitness place. But this person could be into law or they're about honesty, truth. And they don't like uh, lies. Or this is you that does not like all these things okay so i'm seeing a soulful connection is gonna be formed with someone from the past i'm sensing if you allow only if both of you allow this and then i'm seeing your love life is gonna blossom with the red color here one person needs to take efforts like i feel like one person needs to take action the masculine over here the man over here needs to take the action first Okay, in this case, and um, someone's from India. Someone's name is Fatima. Someone's name is Faith. Someone's name could be starting from F. T. You you could have your name having F T D I or your person. Someone is from France. Someone is from Italy, Denmark, uh, Taiwan. This could be a twin flame connection guys if you miss this person from the past and this is a twin flame connection if you figure out this person misses you a lot um again then this is a twin flame okay so tyra could be the name diana D dean jean someone is a french canada someone is from there Korea, Korea, and then you're having uh, Thailand, Indonesia, any Arabic country, yeah, Arabic country like Dubai, um, Afghanistan, Pakistan, America for sure, LA. Detroit, Detroit, someone from the city. I'm seeing uh, Ibiza, Fiji, Trinidad and Tobago. So these are some countries that I got. Africa is also there. Anyway, I feel this person wants to kiss you <laughs> in shot. So that's about it. I hope you've enjoyed this. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Come back for more. See you back again. Bye.